Elizabeth Ward Grayson is an American actress and beauty pageant contestant who won the title of Miss America in 1982. Elizabeth Grace Ward was born on April 3, 1961, in Ozark, Arkansas, the daughter of Patricia Hamp, a nurse, and Jimmy Young Ward, a poultry worker. She was raised in Boonville, Arkansas. The family later moved to Russellville, Arkansas, where Ward dated University of Arkansas trainer Mike Walker and graduated from Russellville High School in 1979. She was a junior accounting major at Arkansas Tech University at the time she entered the Miss America contest. Instead of returning to Arkansas Tech, she used her Miss America scholarship money to study acting at HB Studios in New York City. Grayson won the titles of Miss Arkansas in 1981 and Miss America in 1982. After her year-long work as Miss America, she enrolled in acting classes then relocated to California to pursue a film and television career. Grayson posed nude for Playboy magazine's May 1992 issue. Grayson made her professional feature film debut in Three for the Road with Charlie Sheen. Her film credits also include a featured role in Mark for Death, opposite Steven Seagal, Pass the Ammo with Tim Curry, and the CBS feature 83 Hours Till Dawn with Peter Strauss and Robert Urich. Grayson starred in Lower Level and Discretion Assured with Michael York. On television, Grayson has appeared in Shelley Duvall's Strange Case of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde, Sidney Sheldon's The Sands of Time and Death of the Incredible Hulk. She also appeared with a starring role in the series Extreme for NBC in the syndicated series Renegade and Queen of Swords. Grayson's best-known acting role has been as the recurring character, the immortal Amanda, in the series Highlander, the series and its spin-off series Highlander, The Raven. Grayson, speaking about writing at Tuscon 43 in Tucson, Arizona in December 1999, Grayson filed for bankruptcy protection. Afterward, Grayson was given a few television guest roles, and a supporting role in the made-for-television movie Interceptor Force 2, before taking a long leave of absence from her acting career in 2002. Grayson began doing voiceover work for Blue Hours Productions, which has revived the classic radio anthology Suspense, which airs on Sirius XM. In 2012, Grayson did a character voiceover in the Malaysian animated science fiction film War of the Worlds, Goliath. In 2012, Grayson formed Flapper Films. In 2014, she starred in Coherence, a sci-fi indie thriller. In January 2016, Grayson established Flapper Press and self-published Shaley, a young adult fantasy novel. Grayson made her directorial debut with a documentary short, The Damn Deal About Three Young Drag Queens from Arkansas Who Compete in Female Impersonator Beauty Pageants. Grayson married John Birmingham in 1982, but they divorced in 1984. In 1989, while filming Sundown, The Vampire in Retreat, she met actor Brendan Hughes, and they married soon after. They divorced in 1994. Grayson married Adam Murphy, and they have a daughter. According to Grayson, sometime in 1983, she had a one-night stand with future President Bill Clinton when he was governor of Arkansas. She was married at the time, as was he. In 1992, rumors swirled that Grayson had conducted an affair with Bill Clinton. At first, Grayson dismissed this claim, however, in spring 1998 Grayson recanted her six-year-old denial and stated she had a one-night stand with Clinton in 1982. After claiming this, independent counsel Kenneth Starr, who was investigating Clinton in the Paula Jones lawsuit, issued a subpoena to have her testify to her claim in court. However, Grayson eluded the subpoena and was at one point able to avoid it because Highlander, the Raven was being filmed out of the country. Paula Jones's legal team was also unable to track down Grayson because she had made unscheduled trips to Las Vegas and the Caribbean. Thanks for watching.